There is no stress here in this city. Why or why leaving Chiang Mai? What's your name? Where are you from? Maria. Maria. Where do you think I'm from? Guess it. Or should we not talk about this? Hey champs, what's happening? Welcome to another episode of Tag Along With Chai. We are in the north of Thailand in the city of Chiang Mai. And in this episode, we're going to ask the question, why or why leaving Chiang Mai? Why are the people choosing to leave Chiang Mai? We are at the railway station of Chiang Mai at five o'clock and at six o'clock, there will be trains leaving to Bangkok trying to find some interesting people. We're gonna ask them what they love so much about the city, what the best things are about Chiang Mai, why they choose to leave. For this episode, they're gonna walk in and out of the station and outside of the station, it's not mandatory to wear a mask anymore, no face mask anymore, but inside, you still have to wear your mask. I'll just keep my mask on throughout the episode. This makes making this episode a little bit easier. As usual, at the end of each little interview, I'm gonna ask the people if they have some wisdom to pass on or a message to the world. So gonna be an interesting one again. I hope you're excited. Let's go. Chiang Mai is an awesome place. It's yeah. a beautiful city. It's very cozy and yeah, it's beautiful. Yeah, it, there is no stress here in this city. Okay. Um, you can you have temples everywhere, beautiful yeah. places everywhere, yeah, yeah. and it's a beautiful place to live and to work. Lots of facilities for co-working and co-living oh. as well. So, what, what are you leaving? Are you catching the train today? Yes, I spent a month here, yeah. and now I'm leaving to Bangkok. All oh, right. So why yeah. why or why you're leaving Chiang Mai? Um, because I have to go back to the university there. Oh, yeah, yeah oh, my, studying my wife is studying there, so oh. I will uh, go with her back in, there. In Bangkok? In Bangkok, yeah. Oh, okay, cool. All right, so, so what's, we, sorry? we spent a month here, and we are spending a few months in uh, some cities, ah. but now we have to go back to the university. I got you, got you. Pedro, yeah. what, what are you going to miss the most about Chiang Mai? All right, oh, the food yeah. <laughs> and the people, yeah. uh, the food and the people and this, yeah. This, yeah, lovely city. Okay, yeah. man. <laughs> hey, thanks for stopping by. Do you have a message to the world or some wisdom to yeah, pass on? Yeah, you please come to Chiang Mai and yeah. enjoy yeah. the city. You have okay. to come to Thailand and to, to get to know this beautiful culture and place. Okay. Yeah. Thank you so much. Yeah. Why are why leaving Chiang Mai? Because we don't really have much time left. We have, I think, three more days in Thailand. It's been about a month now, yeah. I'd yeah. say. Yeah. How, mu how much time did you spend in Chiang Mai in this Ooh, month? We actually, this was a last minute thing. So we've only been here for like three days. <gasps> Because everyone was speaking about it, how great it was. Yeah. So, so are you disappointed or are you actually satisfied? Uh, I'm satisfied, I would say. Like people were talking really good things about it, and yeah. I think it's somewhat lived up to expectations. Wow. Okay. But you don't sound really, really excited about it. Oh well, I, I love. We went to uh, Mai Tai yesterday. That oh, yeah? was that was amazing. Oh, oh cool, I love really that. Good. I love oh, okay. that. Hey, what are you gonna miss about Chiang Mai the most then? Uh, I'd probably say the Muay Thai and, yeah, uh, yeah. and uh, we, we, went we stayed in a great hostel as well with very oh. nice people. And which, which hostel are you saying? Stamps. Do you have a message to the world or some wisdom to pass on? Uh, come yeah. to Thailand. Yeah. So say that Thailand. again? Come to Thailand. Was it easy to get here from Hong Kong? Um, yeah, no, to actually I'm studying in England. Oh, yeah. So I took <laughs> a uh, Swiss Air flight down yeah. to Bangkok. Awesome. And then we actually took the sleeper train yeah. uh, up here, so we're taking it back now. Oh, okay, so that's actually the question. Why or why leaving Chiang Mai? Because you're hopping on the train to Bangkok, I believe? Yes, yes. Okay. I actually spent uh, the last two days in Chiang Rai, so this is more like a connecting stop. Oh. But I've spent uh, also three days in Chiang Mai beforehand. Okay, what, what did you like the most about Chiang Mai? Um, I think it's quite a historic city. I was very fascinated by the city wall yeah. and how it lit up in the evening. And then we went also, my, my friend and I, we went to yeah. Doi Su Threp as well in oh, the yeah. evening, yeah. which is amazing as well. Okay. And I went to an elephant sanctuary myself. You're gonna have to catch the train. I think it's yes, leaving in like 20 five, minutes. Yes. So you're gonna get, get a happy meal, eh? I've got two happy <laughs> meals because they have these Oh, I've got these as well. Oh, Minion toys. Oh, yeah, yeah, I got yeah. for my girlfriend as well. Oh, so. there you go. Because you don't get it in England. Uh, <laughs> they're only doing Paddington at the moment. So. Ah, okay. <laughs> oh, such a sweet eh? And, and you probably, you're probably going to enjoy that yourself as of well. Of course, yeah. Do you have a message for the world or some wisdom to pass on? Just explore more of the world. That's it. Yeah. You never know what you'll find. Thanks a lot. I'll let you go. Thank Thanks you. again, mate. Hey, how are you? I'm great, and you? Very good. What's your name? Where are you from? Maria. Maria. Where do you think I'm from? Guess it. Uh, I think uh, Dominican Republic. Oh, it's good, but no, Brazil. Oh, really? Yeah. Okay. Yeah, yeah. Normally, I approach people, <laughs> and you're like, hey, 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 what's, go what's going on? <laughs> no, it's because my husband gave you an interview, and he wanna know where he can find ah, this. Ah, that's I, right. And I came to because he's. Schneider, uh, Pedro. Pedro, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> nice one. Yeah, so, so why, why are you leaving? Because you're studying in Bangkok, right? Yes, I'm. 
finish my master's degree here. Ah, yeah, the awesome. first Brazilian at the university. Is it really? Woo! Really? Kind of look at it go. Really, really. <laughs> awesome. so hey, I like your energy. Can I can I ask you one thing? Of course. Because because why I spoke not? I spoke to your other half already. Okay. So we know already a little bit why you're leaving and what did you like the most about Chiang Mai? <gasps> oh my god, cow soy. Yeah. I love it. <laughs> Have you tried it? Of course, yeah. Yes, yeah, yeah, yeah. please, right? Oh, we like to slap people, so I like to oh, slap yeah, yeah. people. You, you go, you go. Yeah, <laughs> you and, <do> uh, <laughs> and I love the monk trail as well. Going okay. to the Dice to tap. Yeah, very know? nice. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's, everyone needs to do this. Yeah. It's perfect for okay. me, this monk's trail. And uh, because it's a uh, like a pristine temple in the middle of the forest, yeah. very different, you know, like among the others yeah. here at yeah. the city. Uh, this is the, my favorite things here. Can I ask you one more thing? Mm. That is, uh, what you're gonna miss the most from Chiang Mai that you don't have in Bangkok? Oh, the environment here. Yeah. It's totally different. I think, okay. like with the people, it's calm, and you know, I, for me, it's the perfect time here okay. to be. Like Bangkok, so busy, everyone like yeah. here. I love to see the monks everywhere, and yeah. it's more, you know, calm place yeah. to stay. So for me, that I awesome. do. I'm uh, actually taking the channel as well back to Bangkok for a few days because we're flying to the Philippines. Okay. So I'm really excited also to go back to Bangkok because oh, I love the city as well, though. Let Let us know so we can yeah, chat yeah, or do some yeah, yeah, do yeah, some perhaps. salsa thing. Oh, in okay, okay, okay. Let's okay. let's uh, let's walk. Okay. I can introduce you Latin places there. Okay, okay, okay. Hey, thank you very much. Okay, bye bye, safe trip. Are you leaving today? Yeah, I'm heading back to Bangkok to catch the flight back home. I've been here a month already, so. Oh, cool. Are you in a month in Chiang Mai or? Uh, no, just a month around Thailand. I've just yeah. been exploring. So, this is like my last place before I head back to Bangkok and get my flight back. Oh, okay. So. Okay, cool. So, how did, how did you like Chiang Mai? Uh, I've only been here a few days, but it's really, really cool. Yeah. It's like, um, I like the Zoe and Yellow Club. That was pretty sick. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, what else did I do? I went to Pai for a few days. I, I came yeah. up to Chiang Mai yeah. and then went down to Pai a few days just to explore and then went back here. Pai is really, really cool. Aye, nice. Well, we are. We actually been to Pai. I really like the vibes there. But what, what's, uh, what was so good about Chiang, Chiang Mai? Is it the party scene you're saying? Uh, the party scene is pretty good, yeah. yeah. yeah it's great because you meet loads of people. It's like up here, it's so much cheaper than down south. So yeah. I think. It's a lot easier to have like a cheap night out here, which yeah. is kind of ideal if you're a student like me. Hey, what time is your train? Uh, six. Like ah. they, I need to come a bit early. Apparently, I got here a bit early. Didn't realize. Yeah, how you did. Take. Yeah, yeah. Because yeah. I need to always get a ticket like half okay. an hour before. Apparently, but what are you gonna miss the most about Chiang Mai? Or um, about Thailand? Maybe about Thailand. I have to ask you because you you spend some time all over the country, right? Yeah, I mean my favorite place in Thailand is Koh Phi Phi. That was awesome. Yeah. I did, I did one of these party boat tours where they take you around, free oh, yeah. drinks all day, okay. lots of music, s yeah. swimming, it's great. A message to the world or some wisdom to pass on? Uh, f I don't know. Thailand's great, come here if you want. It's cheap, good night out. <laughs> okay, thanks, Jen. I live here 35 years. Okay. And I'm just a hotel owner sending our guests yeah. to the train station. Ah, okay, so you're not leaving. I'm not leaving. Okay. But I did it before. Yeah, so so normally we ask the question or in this episode we ask the question why why leaving Chiang Mai? Um, but for yeah, for you actually it's quite interesting because you you have a 35 year experience in Chiang Mai. So like why would people leave in the first place? Why why do people leave? I mean, it's great place to start in Thailand with Chiang Mai because it's so relaxed, laid back, whatever. It's so beautiful yeah. with all the surroundings. And then when they did the north, they can hit the rest of Thailand easily, much easier than hitting Bangkok first. Yeah. So the connection flying into Chiang Mai and driving the train out to Bangkok or Ayutthaya, yeah. it's perfect. In these 35 years, what's the best thing about Chiang Mai? What's the best thing about the city and about the province? Oh, the best thing, hard to say, but I would say our place. <laughs> <laughs> what's your place then? Our place, the Golden Teak Home Resort. We have a big pool, we have relaxed Thai style buildings, okay. teak wood buildings, yeah. and it's not expensive. Okay. But it's in the range 35 to $50. Yeah. Hey, so how have you been over the COVID period, or should we not talk about this? I'm poor. Yeah. Broke. Yeah. <laughs> Almost broke, yeah. Almost broke. Yeah. But you're still surviving, you still... Yes, some people survived, some not. Yeah. Mm, but I'm doing a farm now okay. to survive. Yeah. I, I moved out to our countryside further yeah. south, Sampatong. Okay. 
Okay. I do chicken, fish, and others, so we yeah. have enough food for the last two and a half years. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Well, good to see you. You're still a positive man, I see. Thank so, uh, yeah. Good luck with the business. You have a message to the world or uh, some um, wisdom to pass on? Well, don't be overexcited and try to enjoy the people from Thailand without overwhelming them. Lay back and enjoy here. Why or why leaving Chiang Mai? I don't think there's anyone leaving the city because they really want to. No, they have to go back to work, back studying, or they just have to finish their holidays. Champs, if you're coming to Thailand or if you are in Thailand, in the south of Thailand, or you're planning your trip to Thailand, you're gonna have to check out the north as well. There's Chiang Rai, there's Pai, there's Nan. There are a lot of beautiful places in the north to explore. We're based in the north of Thailand, but we're also traveling around Southeast Asia. We're making our way slowly to the Philippines. But before we fly out of Thailand, I'd like to take you to Bangkok, meeting some interesting people there as well. I'm pretty sure a special shout out to Cornelis. He was very generous via buy me a coffee. Thank you so much. We're buying better gear with this money, but it also just keeps us on the road, keeps us going. So it means a lot. Thank you so much. Cornelis was saying he's making it up to Chiang Mai as well in August, so I'm really happy for you champ. And I also hope that more and more people are coming to this beautiful city. The city is open again, the country is open again. What are you waiting for? I hope you are able to book your flights this year, if not next year. Thank you for watching till the very end. If you enjoyed this video, please give us a thumbs up. If you enjoy this type of content, interviewing people, but also traveling like you've never traveled before, please consider to subscribe to the channel. I would like to say from the north of Thailand at the railway station of Chiang Mai, bye for now and stay champ.